Mealtime is a whole thing around here and I'm excited to be working with Home Chef on today's video. Today I'm going to be cooking with my girl and we're going to be making a quick meal for Brian and I for a date night in. Okay, so I brought my box over here so I could open it up and show you guys what is inside. Okay, so it comes with little menu cards. I'm sure you guys have seen this before, but I'll just show you what's inside of our box. Um, it comes with the menu cards, which is nice because they're hole punched, um, which means I can go ahead and add them to our recipe list uh, in our home binder. I'm going to be showing you guys our home binder in a little bit, so... You can look forward to that. I'm really excited. I basically got um, four meals. My options were to do two meals, which were four servings um, a piece, or I could have done four meals, which were two servings a piece. And I opted for the four meals at two servings a piece, basically because with our whole food allergy story, just food has been a whole ordeal with us. As we're knocking off food allergies one at a time, um, it's hard to experiment and try new things because if they don't like it, then you spent all of this energy trying to make something for the whole family of which they did not eat. My kids eat really basic things most of the time and that is fine for them, but not so good for myself and my husband. So, um, I thought it would be nice to do the four meals at two servings and I could just try these meals out for both myself and Brian and let the kids taste them and if they like them then it's something that I can try to do moving forward and if not it's no big deal because it was for Brian and I anyway. I thought it would be great for like a little date night in um, for us because you know that's a whole thing getting away with your boo. So <laughs> um, I ended up choosing two options that were more like lunch um, lunch options which were great because I can pack up a lunch for myself and then a lunch for Brian to take off to work. I thought it was a cute idea um, with a little note or message, you know, trying to keep first things first. So um, I got the chicken and smoked Gouda sandwich, the wild mushroom and pesto linguine, the chicken chimichangas, and then the steak strip masala risotto. So it'll tell you what's inside of your box, all of the ingredients that are included. Over here it tells you the prep and cook time, um, the days to cook within, the difficulty level, and the spice level. And then of course on the back it has all of the instructions with a photo. When you open up your box there's this Padding, which I am pretty sure it's to keep everything nice and cool, is an ice pack. Quality ingredients below, perfectly chilled. That's a super cute little detail. You guys know I'm all about details. Okay, so here are my meals. One of the things I had heard um, about them, which I also agree, is that some of the other um, meal kit services everything will just come in the box and you have to sort and separate them. This comes in like little packages, which I can see why it is super helpful to have it this way. It tells me which meal this is. So this is the wild mushroom and pesto linguine. And it's nice because it tells me what it contains, milk and wheat. Um, this is really helpful for, I'm sure most people, but for me in particular because, you know, my babies have so many different restrictions so sometimes some of these things are a part of the ingredients that I can just omit so I'm sure that the milk part of this recipe is probably the cheese which if I made this for my son Kendall who cannot do milk product I would just omit the cheese so I guess we'll see which ones I can omit some and which ones are just completely incorporated so the next one is this chicken and smoked Gouda sandwich. And those are my last two options. This one is my chicken chimichangas. This is another lunch option. There's some cheese in there and it looks like salsa and tomato and lime. This one is the steak strip masala risotto and that contains milk. And at the very bottom, I have another package of ice um, to keep it nice and cool. And here is my meat. So this is my chicken and my steak here. The last thing I see all tucked away 
Oh my goodness, it's a binder. I didn't know <laughs> I didn't know that was gonna be in there. So that's really cute. Um, I thought I was just gonna add my um, recipes to my home binder, but there's actually a recipe binder here. Welcome to Home Chef. Inside, here's all the information and instructions on cooking your meals and such. That, whatever that is, looks really yummy. And of course, I really like how they include um, recycling instructions. Yeah, a little binder to keep your recipes in. So I'm gonna go ahead and add my recipes to my little binder, which is super cute. That was, that was a nice surprise. <laughs> I actually think I might do this wild mushroom and pesto linguine. Okay, and that is everything that is inside. Okay, you guys, I'm about to be really extra and grab my apron. <laughs> because why not? So Savannah put her apron and her hat on as well, and she is going to be helping me cook. Right, girl? She's ready. Mommy, you want me to wash all the photos? Yes, you're going to be washing the photos, girl. <laughs> we just practiced that, okay? Okay, so these are sun-dried tomatoes. So the next thing we're gonna do is we need to clean off the produce. Ready? Like you said, so move your stool over and you're gonna wash it off. So you're gonna turn on the water. I'm gonna spray that. Yep. Go, girl. <laughs> so you guys, this is like homeschool cooking class. <laughs> Yeah, you're doing good. Wild mushroom and pesto linguine. So actually, I think you can cut the mushrooms. I'm gonna give you a butter knife so that oh. you can cut them. Give me the next this one. This looks disgusting. <laughs> you don't it like mushrooms? Like you don't like mushrooms. It looks like mayonnaise. It is not mayonnaise, girl. It looks like mayonnaise. Girl. How does a mushroom look like mayonnaise? Cause look, look at this way. She is cutting the mushrooms into slices. Get it, girl. She's doing a really good job. Safety in the kitchen. Her little chef hat is so cute. <laughs> I was gonna do it. Good job. Mm, I'll cut them. Sometimes it, the mushrooms are sticky. Mm. Don't turn them. Oh, I guess I should be helping you. Okay, so mommy's gonna cut. I think mommy's gonna cut this shallot. I'm gonna cut this shallot while she's cutting up the mushrooms. And we just need the kale to be cut into pieces. Savannah, mommy needs you to read what's next, okay? This is where we are now. What does it say? Cook the pasta. Colander. This is a colander. Okay, so let's cook this pasta, girl. The Can I do it? So what you have to do, let me show you. I know. Cut it in half. Yep, you break it in half. Yeah, how do you know? You got this, girl. Okay, so you have to cut it in half. Pop it in. <laughs> okay, do this one. Yeah. <laughs> Next thing we're going to do is cook the vegetable. After the mushrooms are brown, we're going to put all of our veggies in. So we're going to put this, Veggie. this, and this. Pesto. You going to put the pesto in for me? Mm-hmm. Ready? Okay, go ahead. It actually smells good. This smells like something I had. <laughs> so now we're going to put the pasta in. You ready? Yeah. Okay. Ooh, it got some. Look, him. Yummy. Savannah cooked it. It looks good. It actually does. It smells like something I had before. Yeah, it's real. really good. 
<laughs> okay, so that was a lot of fun. This was like... <laughs> So this is like our cooking class. So now the food is done. Brian is going to go pick up pizza for the kids. And then after they have eaten and are all in bed, then we'll probably have our little stay-at-home date night. Right, Brian? Correct. And watch a movie. So this was a lot of fun. I'm going to leave all the information in the description box. Did you have fun? Okay, so apparently the kids like it. It's the best yeah, part. Yeah, it is. So they like mm -hmm. it. Yay! <laughs> so good. Wow. Papa, it is all dead. Oh, they do have manners, you guys. <laughs> so you like it, Kendall? Mm -hmm. Really? Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's good. You guys, they're eating all our food. That was not a part of the plan. Thank you guys for watching, and thanks again to Home Chef for sponsoring today's video. Remember to check the description box below and use the code to get $30 off of your first order. You guys should really give it a try. I'm really excited about finding a way that it could fit in well for our family and finding new things that the kids enjoy. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!